and it's definitely raining. Y'all, look at his pants. They're see-through. <laughs> and his shoes are like very soaked. Hey. So we decided to wake up early and go to the farmer's market. And then we get downtown Houston. I'm with TXOS, so by the way. <laughs> and uh, it's raining like crazy, but the sign said, rain or shine. So if you see all these vendors still out here, hopefully I can find something nice. Um, something to mukbang. Let's see, what, um, let's see something we can get, y'all. It's raining like crazy. But you know, the grind never stops. You got the pumpkin people. Let's go this way. My camera's gonna keep getting wet. I hope this turns out at least decent enough. Well, oh, I gotta watch these puddles. I'm over here playing hopscotch. I'm so wet. That's what she said. All right, so we got a honey stand over here. This guy's got all the nice honey. It's really hard to find some good honey. Okay, so we got. How much you say this was? Three dollars. Three dollars? For a little piece of honeycomb. I have soap too, but I didn't want it to get wet. Right, oh, yeah. I understand. I think I want to do a small one. Like this. Uh -huh. Yeah. How much is that? Nine dollars? Nine dollars. I can afford it. <laughs> you okay with being on here? Sure, yeah, okay, of course. Cool. All right, we got the... Hive Bee Farm. I've always wanted to be a beekeeper. So I accidentally set my camera to time-lapse mode, but this bee guy gave us a some wax because I gave him a tip. Um, it was very good. You can chew on it kind of like gum. Um, I liked it. Taylor liked it. and It was worth the wait. Uh, I'm just going to walk you through all this. Uh, this next lady, she was selling some soups. They looked good, and it was a little chilly out. I wanted to try some, especially the one with that egg on it, but I had to go get another one, fry it, and that was hectic, so... We got up out of there. Maybe next time, if you're there, try it. This next guy's got some spices. Whole lot of spices. Taylor actually ended up buying a hot one, but I don't get down like that. He's like, I got some guac. I'm like, all right, I'll take the guac. Good looking. Um, I'm gonna try it later. I'll let y'all know how it is. These people, it's a vegan spot. So everything there was vegan. I ended up getting like a vegan egg and cheese taco. Um, it was very good. Um, took a while to come out in the rain but here it is the anticipation is killing me do i like it oh yum taylor you want some yeah all right girl here you go the anticipation do you like it you like the vegan taco mm, is it good it's good yeah uh -huh. all right these next people i'm really sorry i missed the uh audio on this because they were very informative very nice people they had uh fermented garlic and had a whole lot of products spices uh, mustard salts i actually end up getting a mild sauce for wings and uh we'll see how it is now what is this how much are they this is five and this one's six okay i'll get two it? okay well i'll get one of each one of each okay yeah, no problem. that way you can try both yeah for sure oh, i want the goat one yeah yeah, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get gold and chocolate. So two and then one. So yeah. two goats and a chocolate. Yeah. Anything else it. for y'all? That's all. Awesome. Y'all are so brave out here in the rain. Of oh, course. Yeah. Where we drive always oh, drive back. Oh, wow. yeah. well, welcome. It's such a great farmer's market. Yeah. When it's not pouring rain. Yeah. Of course, you know. I was watching Normally like it's a phenomenal market. I was watching YouTube videos about like other countries. I'm like, I wonder if Houston has I don't know, I've been here since February. I'm like, I wonder if Houston has one. So I looked it up and I'm like, oh they do. This oh, yeah. 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 yeah, there's one every weekend. This one's every weekend, of course. Mm -hmm. Um I have a little bag, but it's paper. I don't know. Yeah. That's fine. Just so we can put it in our bag. Yeah. Thank you guys so much. You're so welcome. Thank, Thank you. you. You're Fresh pasta. Beans bar. Flowers. Oh, and some Indian food. Let's see. <laughs> Indian curry. I love me some nice curry. 
I have curries, I have samosas, I have none. Ooh. I think I got to pull up over here. That's what we want. I'm always here, so I'll see you again, my friend. What's this guy got? Yeah. Hey. Oh. Guys out of here, some fermented foods over here. All sorts of fermented foods. All wild. I also have big jars of green beans and then uh, cucumbers, so pickles that are naturally fermented. Awesome. That we grew in our own backyard. All right. Looks yummy. I don't want to come from here. I want. I, I just. I look. You want to try it? Though. I have samosa as well. I have beef. I have chicken. I have lamb and uh, potatoes and spinach and cheese. Samosa? What's that? It's like in Benada. Let me show you. Oh, how much? Yeah, our prices are. Do you have a lamb one? I have one. Can I do a lamb one? Lamb is $12. Okay. Do you want any garlic naan to go with it? No, thanks. I, we bake our own fresh garlic naan. There you go. Uh, you can freeze them as well, they are beautiful. Oh no, I'm cool on the naan. Alright. $12. Very good. Would you like a bag? Um, sure. Thank you, sir. You have a wonderful Thank you, day. you too. Thank you. I can pull a little bonsai right for you. Thirty-one years. This oh, wow. guy? How much is this? Like twenty thousand? Not for sale. Now you gotta keep that one. I got a thousand of his babies growing. Oh yeah. yeah. These cost a lot, don't they? Huh? These cost a lot, huh? Thirty-four bucks. Thirty-four dollars. Can't even it? get dinner for what that cost. Right. You mm -hmm. buy her lunch and you've already spent that money. <laughs> that money's gone. If I wasn't leaving Houston, I'd definitely get one of these. But this is awesome. Right. Where are you going to? Uh, back to Wisconsin. Yeah. It's awesome. That's well, how you know. You'd be know. really rare up in Wisconsin. Huh? You'd be something really rare up there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. All right. And we got yeah. the mushroom <laughs> shop. We got some lion's mane and some oysters, huh? Yeah, yeah. I got some more in the, the cooler, but it was getting wet, so I just limited them out. How much for... Can I do a fourth a pound of the lion's mane and then... Of the oysters? Or the oysters. Okay. Ooh, I've never had this before. I've had the powders and stuff. Yeah, it's, it's got kind of a crabby lobster flavor. It does well in cream sauces and stir fries. Um, Can I do, uh, I'll do half a pound. Okay. Of that. Mushroom, mushroom, mushroom. You got any magic ones? <laughs> Not for sale. No. <laughs> Not at the market, I don't. Extra layer. All right. So we need a quarter and a half will be fourteen dollars. Appreciate y'all coming out in this rain too. Oh yes. Yeah. Thank y'all for being here. <laughs> Appreciate you taking the wet money. <laughs> <laughs> it's been the same. Hello. That's all that matters. Yeah. Once it dries, Thank it's going you. to somebody else's hands. Yeah, I'll take wet money over a card any day. <laughs> yeah, you can take a pick of the, the steak too. If you want. So and then your website's right there? Yeah, website's right there, uh, wagyu.com. All right, awesome. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah. Y'all, this man talks about wagyu steak. I do. Two it's, times. But oh. the crazy thing is, like, that price was is really good because yeah. in restaurants, I've like paid, huh? I paid $60 for, like, a sliver of meat. And here, I hope this is wine. It is. It's Texas wine. Texas wine. Yes, I would. Awesome. What's your What's your favorite one? Um, I really like our Grand Reserve. It's the best barrel from 2019. Um, it's a dry red, gold, and then he prefers me a little sweeter. Grape is a really nice. It's really white. Right? Yeah, it's I'll white. do that. How much is it? That one's 26. We do have a promotion where if you buy two or more, you get a jar of jelly. This is our wine jelly. It's really okay. Long jelly. It's alcohol free, and I like to use crackers and cream cheese. Really nice. 
You're killing me. Yeah. Okay, I, I like red wine. I don't like sweet wine. Okay, so yeah. Let me Uh, I'll buy two of them because I want some jelly. Yeah. Well, if I buy one and you buy one, you can still get jelly. Okay, cool. Yeah. Unless you want to. No, I'll, I can yeah, come I'll back. Yeah. Yes, we're there every Saturday. Because if I get one, it's going to be done by the night. <laughs> All right. I mean, two. If I get two, one's going to be done. And I need to pay some stuff. Okay. Yeah. 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 And then do you want Grand Reserve or do you want the one that's a bit lighter? Um, right. which one tastes better? Um, I like the Grand Reserve. Older. Um, it, our wines are very natural. Uh -huh. Very, very natural. So for me, they taste kind of like grape juice. No, they're, they're, they're okay. very fruitful. They're delicious. That's what I like. Yeah. So it just depends on if you want to take a lighter or bigger. I'll do the bowl. Yeah. This one I can't bowl. Okay, cool. In from Wisconsin, you know, I had to stop at the cheese station. Let's see what we got here. Oh, all these spreads? Mm -hmm. All these are spreads? No? Do you have any, uh, what's in there? Is that cheddar? It's a cheddar like, like, it's a, it's an alpine style cheese. Okay. Um, how much? 23 per pound. Slices are about half a pound. So, between 10 and 12 dollars, depending by the slice. Alright, let's see what I want to try. Everything is good. Is it? This looks pretty good. That's great when it's grated. It's very good for grating. Grating? Um, what's something good to eat on like a cracker? I mean, I have the spread. I have the Brie style. The Asiago is fantastic. It's an Alpine style, but it's very young, soft. Yeah. All right, I will. I'll try this guy. How much? Twelve dollars. Oh. That's a good cut. We'll put it in the box. Let's do a dollar off for the rain, for buying during the rain. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Alright, I thought I saw something else over here. Oh, that was the first people we stopped at. And they're gone, we said we'd be back. And they left. She, she just walked away too. I know. All right, so we are we are officially we are done here. We got a lot of stuff. Um, get out of this rain. Get out of these wet clothes. <laughs> Y'all can see how wet I am. People are looking at me crazy. Let me show them, y'all. When I so say so, you're too far away. Y'all look at his pants. They're see-through, <laughs> and his shoes are like very soaked. Hey, yay. Um, this won't be my last video. I'm gonna do like a haul, show everything I got, and then in the next few mukbangs, I think I'm gonna try everything with it. So, and I will mention like the farmers market. And if you are in Houston, you need to come down because it is awesome. It'll probably be way better on a sunny day too, and the, there'll be music playing and stuff. Actually, it's perfect because the music is not playing today. So, uh, that's good. All right, see y'all next time. Keep my shit been going, oh, see, no, you are not my bro Bleak with acting like you know me